what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so in this video i just want to talk about what should happen when the uh or how jeepers creepers the franchise should end so for those of you who are familiar with the with the series you know that jeepers creepers 3 was originally titled jeepers creepers cathedral it was going to have jack taggart trish jenner uh the sister from the first film and the father from the second film they were going to team up and they were going to take out the creeper that is not what happened in the third film that we got we ultimately got a movie that was set in between the first and the second film uh but if they are going to wrap this up properly and put and send the creeper off in a nice manner i think that what they should do is kind of yes stick to what they said they were going to do and pick up where jeepers creepers 2 ended uh it doesn't necessarily have to pick up immediately afterwards in that barn with the taggarts the film can start off showing us probably a little flashback or something that's set in the early in the early uh roman times period something that's old something that's dated start several centuries ago just to show how old the creeper is and we can see how he probably was around here in the gladiator times uh, a few other things he was probably here for several historical events and he was he was um, around for all of this stuff but just was never documented of course because he's all he's he just hasn't been able to get documented uh but it'd be nice to have a flashback or two of a few things that he did in the past or have him in like the wild wild west i think even that was a consideration at the point uh i think the movie should start off in setting the old times and then we should just jump ahead to 2024 2023 one of those two years uh, and then we should pick up and follow some survivors from the second film as well as the first film including the taggarts and trish jenner it shouldn't just be them solely um and then since the cathedral script did leak online the best route here to me would then be to rewrite the characters just rewrite new background characters come up with a few new characters to introduce the audiences bring back some familiar faces such as giselle from the first film she could be a factor in the creepers demise um we can learn more about poho county east nine we can learn a whole lot of stuff about what the creeper has done in that area since he's been there how long he's been there we probably can find out a little bit more about other areas he's been to or traveled to it'll just be very interesting to see what what could happen and what he's done in that area now if you're gonna bring back the truck again i'm honestly gonna say you need to ignore anything that happened in jeepers creepers 3 and in, in fact ignore jeepers creepers 3 entirely if you're gonna make jeepers creepers 4 i think the best bet would be to ignore the the third film and render in anything that happened in that film non-existent and just keep jeepers creepers 1 and 2 canon jeepers creepers 3 you can act, you can just ignore it because jeepers creepers 3 has no connection to the first two films whatsoever outside of the fact that it starts off right after the first and it's before the second but it really doesn't do anything to connect itself to either film it doesn't bridge right into the second film like many people claimed it did it does not bridge directly into the second film it doesn't the first film doesn't really have that much of a connection to it at all either it starts off in that night and then it goes off and does its own thing and it starts doing something that's really out there by introducing the plot device that i kind of went on a rant on a few videos ago which i will leave as a recommendation at the end of this one uh but i would ignore jeepers creepers 3 in its entirety i would bring back trish i would bring back uh the taggarts bring back any survivors from the school bus who may want to bring back any characters that you feel necessary and find people to to uh portray them all grown up from the bus anyone from the first film such as sergeant tubbs he can come back i think that would be the only character i'd bring back from jeepers creepers 3 um you can't even talk about kenny brandon anymore because someone brought this to to my attention uh, Kenny Brandon was in fact an African American male in the first film but in the third movie they portrayed him as a Caucasian male the reason that's an issue is because it's so tightly they say it's supposed to be directly set after the first film well if it's set directly after the first film how can Kenny Brandon just all of a sudden be a white man now after he was just seen as a white as a uh, African American male when Derry found him it's just not it's just not logistic I wouldn't bring Kenny Brandon back I would make mention of the character still you can make mention of the characters but i wouldn't have any flashbacks or anything to do with showing him physically now since we no longer have a complete definitive answer as to what he is he's 
he one second he's black and now he's white so um as far as the character of Derry, i would try to get justin long to to come back if possible i feel like you could get a flashback out of him or two even then you don't need justin long to put him in the film you could use footage from the first movie uh that's just how i would end it i i don't think we need to exactly find out what the creeper is either in entirety just kind of dance around the topic and let people kind of come to their own conclusions make it ambiguous if you will uh find out some few more secrets about him find out he has a lot of other weapons up his up in his arsenal maybe find another layer maybe he has more bodies stitched up around the walls down there maybe this layer is bigger that's what i would do uh, i would have the movie go out at a bang i'd have like someone giving a voiceover commentary perhaps to lead us into the last film and to close out the last film they're kind of just recollecting their memories and telling us the story of how he met his demise but those are my thoughts on how jeepers creepers should end what do you guys think about it let me know down in the comment section below if you haven't already make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video in the description i'll have links on my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there to let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you would like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video